Konnichiwa, hola, bonjour, hello, what's up, what's going on? It's Wednesday, welcome back to News on Lock with SJ for the Killer Killer weekly live stream. <laughs> I nearly said live show podcast. Woo, I wish it was, I wish I could see you all. So how is everybody? It's mental health week this week, so um, make sure you're all chatting to people, using this time to connect with people. If you're feeling like shit, go and tell someone. How nice is this weather? It is absolutely amazing today. It's been 28 degrees. So have any of you guys been like taking up new stuff while in lockdown? I've seen a lot of people baking banana bread, crocheting and painting pots and stuff like that. I mean, I've been decorating my dad's whole house while I've been here. I've been busy. I've always wanted to be able to quad skate because I always have this, you know, vision of me cruising along down this beach, like in my little shorts and my socks, like skating along. So I bought some quad skates a little while back uh, for a shoot, but I've never really had the time to like learn. And I went out for like the first time in forever yesterday. And it's really hard. It's like harder than you think it's going to be. Uh, just even standing on skates as an adult is quite scary because when you're a kid you just don't care but like as you're an adult you're like oh I'm gonna fall, I'm gonna break something, I'm gonna fall on my face. I'm enjoying that so tell me what you guys have been uh, doing that's a new thing in this time, you know, in lockdown. So my first guest on this fine Wednesday evening is Kid Bookie. He just released a single yesterday. It's a collab with American rapper Kamiyada and it's called Say It With Your Chest. I like Kid Bookie because he combines the grime sort of rap genre with the metal trap, all that kind of genre. It's just heavy and it's gritty and it's raw and I just love it. Kid Bookie in the past has done a collab with um, Corey Taylor from Slipknot. He's also got links with all the Slipknot crew, uh, DJ Sid as well, he's good friends with him, he was doing something with him. He told me when I saw him recently that he's got loads of stuff lined up, so I think he's one to watch this year for sure. And he has a little message for everyone, um, and despite his, uh, <laughs> despite the way he sounds, he is actually very happy to send us a message really. Shout out SJ for being alive during COVID-19, so I can send her a fucking video. Apparently I have music coming out and I have to share it on a platform like this because we can't go outside, but I am. I don't really know what to say. Kind of self-indulgence right now, right? We've got some new shit coming out, some projects and shit and all that. Some dope collabs. Shout out Good Charlotte. Shout out my other people, them. Um, fuck the status quo and fuck you. Have a good day. Next up I have Sarah, or better known as Hello The Mushroom. She is a street artist. I love her pin-up style, her energy, all of her artwork is like super hot chicks. Like she does a lot of drawings on top of cool cards. It's just really cool, bright, amazing art. So here's a little bit from what she's been up to in lockdown. Hello The Mushroom. Hello The Mushroom. My name is Sara, uh, also known as uh, Hello The Mushroom. I'm a London-based uh, paste-up artist and I've been uh, on lockdown since March. In this time, I've been working on several projects, um, some money art, uh, skateboard, um, also some calling cards uh, that I paint uh, and also preparing to move <laughs> and learning Norwegian. <laughs> Thank you for watching and if you are interested in looking at more of my art you can find it up on Instagram under the handle hello the mushroom. If I mentioned the words Eroc dog to you, would you know who I'm talking about? <laughs> A lot of you would, some might not. So if you don't know, or even if you do know, you're gonna love it anyway. Here's a little piece on my best friend, the skateboarding French bulldog called Eric. <laughs> I think that's probably about time tonight. Uh, thank you so much again. Love you all. Thanks for like commenting, sharing, blah blah blah. See you next week. Big up yourselves.